News first contacted all respective factions over these influencers. It was noted that the Federation of University Teachers Association has influenced the removal of the chairperson of the University Grants Commission. Yes, as a trade union we exerted pressure. We had justifiable reasons to exert pressure. The main reason was that during her term of service, she made the university system a colony of Apart from this, another reason is the conflict of interest in her duties. For an instance, her husband has applied for the post of vice-chancellor at the Colombo University while she was functioning as the chairperson of the University Grants Commission. I think another infamy during her tenure would be the enrollment of a student depending on a letter of recommendation from Namal Rajapaksa. That itself is enough for her to decide to resign. That is why we are asking her to resign. State Minister for Education, Professor Rajiv Vijay Singh, explained the situation that has arisen due to the incident. I have discussed with the President and I have even written a letter to inform that I cannot work in this condition. I have pointed out that it is very difficult for me to work in this condition. So I need an alternative. A letter with several alternatives has been presented to the President and he will take a decision.